What's good, guys? It's Sam here, and I um, I hear people saying like, "Oh, I'm gonna start in January for whatever their goals are," and if you're not already fucking doing what you're gonna do, like. Just look at the data. You're not going to fucking do it in January. Just plain and simple. Like, if, if you don't want to put in the work today or it, over this past week and have decided mentally that you're going to start in January on whatever it is that you want to do, I mean, just accept that you're going to fail. You are not willing to put in the work towards your goals. They're not that important to you. Living the life you currently have and uh, being okay with whatever that is, whether you want to make more money, whether you want to work out, whether you want to have a better relationship, whether you want to have more friends, any of that, you're okay with that. Because if you weren't, you would start today. You would have started last week. And when you're ready to put in the work to reach your goals, when you're ready to make the sacrifices. And I use the word sacrifices to deal with the mindset you have today. And to me, saving 65% of my income, that's not even a sacrifice. Like, it's just a lifestyle. I don't have any desire to spend all the money I make. I just don't. I have zero desire. Um... I, I don't. It's not even slightly a sacrifice whatsoever. I buy the food I want to buy. Like, I buy shit that I want to buy. I buy a new phone and every single year. I, you know, buy a $1,300 drone. Like, I flew it out into the ocean. Bought another, I, like, I, I just... The money is not an issue. It's just... It's all up here. And when that changes... That's when you start making steps towards your goals. That's when you'll start putting in the actual time and the actual work it takes to reach whatever it is that you say you want. And you'll stop spending time, money, or whatever it is on things that actually don't bring you happiness in, in the long run. Besides the novelty of the moment when you get something and that wears off extremely fast. You know, if you've ever bought anything new and you have any ambition to change your life in some capacity, whether that's, um, you know, you want more money or you uh, want a different lifestyle or you want a more passionate relationship or anything it requires you to put in the effort to change whatever that is and it doesn't come and that's why so many people fail it doesn't come from just wishing and fucking hoping like that's literally what you're doing right now and probably the vast majority of the population because they're not willing to put in the effort to reach whatever it is they say they want. And if you don't want to, that's fine. Just accept that you don't actually want that. Like, okay, you don't actually want to put in the work to do it, which is fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Don't beat yourself up. But recognize that you don't really want that. Because you're not willing to, to let go of some of these other things, whether that's the time, whether that's putting in the work to, in the relationship, putting in more love and more passion and compassion and caringness into your relationship, whether it's an intimate relationship or it's relationship with friends or whatever the case is or um, at, at work or anything. You're just not willing to. And that's okay. But don't fool yourself into thinking that that's what you want. Because you'll do what you want. You want to go home and have a beer and sit around and be a fat ass and do whatever the fuck you want? Cool. Except that's what you want. And don't pretend 
and put on a facade that you want more out of life when you're not willing to actually put in any modicum of fucking effort to reach that. It's that simple. If you, uh, if you like this, make sure you press that subscribe button. If you don't like this, make sure you press that subscribe button anyway. Uh, appreciate you watching, and um, I will talk to you soon. Peace.